Good morning, good afternoon, or good evening. I posed a question, and the question is, what do these seven items, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, there are, there are seven items. What do they have in common? And I don't know if you might have seen the question or if you guessed it, but first I'm going to tell you what they are, in case you don't know. This is a box that a set of six underwear came in. Yes, underwear. Crazy, isn't it? This is a business envelope, or otherwise called a security envelope, where they put designs on the inside so you can't see through the envelope. And this is a, it says like a box. Um, this is a padded envelope. And I actually was trying to remove my address stuff, and I sort of tore it a little bit. <laughs> but um, that's what it was. It's an envelope. I think everybody might recognize this. It's a box that cream cheese comes in. This is a cute little book for a wonderful friend. And uh, I guess it's not such a wonderful friend. <laughs> but um, I thought it was perfect. Starbucks bag. Some tasty treat came in this. Grease spots. Yep. And this is a package that um, a piece of clothing came in. If I'm not mistaken, it probably came in this brown envelope. I'm not real sure now because I collect so many different things. It's a little banged up here and there. But So anyway, what these things have in common is that they can be used to make one same similar common item. And that is an art journal. You bet. That's right. You don't have to start out with a book. You don't have to start out with a spiral or, you know, any certain kind of thing. I'm going to make all of these things into their very own art journal. Stay tuned. You'll want to see this.